Hi everybody, I hope you're doing well. I am here today, well today's Sunday. We just got in from church a little bit ago and I'm trying to upload, well I'm trying to film on a weekend so I can upload and it will upload to the regular schedule that I'm trying to propose for myself, which is either going to be Wednesday or Thursday. So wish me luck. Okay, so this video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I got from the um, Color Club, uh, my Color Club haul. And this is when they have their mystery polishes for a dollar, and they had some other polishes that um, were discounted too. I think they were like clearance polishes. So let me go ahead and show you, because I've got quite a bit. All right, let me turn this camera around. Alrighty. Okay, as you can see, I haven't really taken it out of the box, and I apologize for that. I didn't swatch, oops, let me, let me get these out first. Okay, there we go. I didn't swatch any of these because it's just, I don't know, I was just lazy, so <laughs> no real rhyme or reason to it. So, okay. Um, oops, I'm trying to see something really quick. Uh, uh oh. Oh, okay, got it. All right, so these right here are all of, let me do them this way. Okay. So these right here are all of the clearance polishes. Um, all the clearance, these are the, well, I shouldn't say clearance polishes, but I guess they are clearance polishes too, but they have them labeled as mystery $1 polishes. They're all $1 each, so you can't get, you literally can't even get polish from the dollar store because they're now $125. So these were a really good deal, and I haven't purchased any Color Club polishes in a while, so I decided to go ahead and grab them. So I'm just going to show you what I got, and we'll go from there. I got 20 of these, and I got 21 polishes all together. I'll start with this one. This is one of their scented polishes here. This is called, this is in the scent of eggnog, and I think it's scented when it's dried, but I love eggnog, and so I just had to get it even though it may not smell like eggnog I still wanted it so yeah this one is this one is called eggnog wait is that let's see oh y'all this no yeah oh it's called nog nog who's there okay that is so tiny right there at the bottom I wear glasses even and even I can barely see that, but it's called Nog Nog, who's there, and it's a scented, it's in the scent of eggnog when it's dry. So, got that, and this is a, this is a glitter polish. Hopefully y'all can see that. There you go. All right. Oh no, that does not smell like eggnog at all. That smells like nail polish thinner, or like you're in a nail polish shop. Okay, the next one that I got is called Meant to Be, M-I-N-T to Be. This is like a, is this a grungy, ugly green? Yeah, because when I think of mint, I'm thinking of like a mint color, like a light colored um, mint polish, like a mint green, like a light color, like a pastel mint green. Um, so this is not what I think of at all, but sort of a grungy, ugly green color. Uh, like an olive green, I think. A light olive grungy green. So, I will show you what this looks like here. There you go. Okay, if I can do that without putting polish on myself. Okay. Then this right here, this is called... Ooh. Okay. This must be a misprint, because I don't even... Okay, I'll put this up here so hopefully y'all can see it, but I don't know if you can. It's called In The Snuff. I think that's it. S? No, okay, I got it. In The Buff. I thought that B was an S, so okay, but it makes sense now. Okay, In The Buff. Hopefully you can see that. In The Buff. 
that makes sense because it's sort of a white. I don't, this is not a clear, I about to say a clear white. What is that? Okay, not a clear white, but this looks like it's got like a little, um, well, I don't know. Let me see. Yeah, this isn't, this is like a, like a pinky white a little bit. That's what it looks like to me because it's not a blank, um, not like a white white. It looks like it's got a little bit of pink in there. So that is in the buff. Oh my gosh, we never got fat. Then this right here, this is a holographic polish. And, okay. Huh. I'll have to, this one looks a little weird. I don't know if it's holographic because I don't see that. I see more like a pearl color, something like that instead of holographic. But this one is called Smooth Move. Hopefully you can see that there. And let's open this up. Yeah, whoops, okay. This is what it's looking like, and y'all, I am not seeing holographic at all. I'm seeing this more, it, it may be a slight, slight, slight holographic, but it's looking more like it's more pearly to me like a pearly pink purple. Yeah. All right. This one is nice and bright. And let's see, what am I looking at here? Because this definitely looks like an old label here, or maybe this is their new label. But anyway, it's different from what I normally, yeah. This is what I'm used to seeing on their label. And then this is Color Club New York. Um, so I'm not sure which is new, but this is just different. So this one is called Tube Top. Hopefully you can see that. This letter writing is so small. Or Like I might need a new prescription for my glasses, but yeah, really small. This is a bright hot pink. This would be perfect for a pedicure. Can you see that right there? Yep. going out of town to Miami in September and I will maybe use that. Okay, this one, now this is a glass bottle. I don't know, like a frosted glass bottle. Never seen this before. Hmm, and it doesn't say it's like a different, like a different line or like a different um, product line or anything like that. It's just also different from the other two bottles. Um, but this one is called Hip Hip Hooray. Hip Hip Hooray, do you see that? And this is what, now when I think of mint green, this is what I'm thinking of. There you go. You see that? That is mint green. So this should be called meant to be. Yeah, maybe it's mislabeled, I don't know. I'll have to look these up. I haven't taken them out of, like, as you saw, they were just literally in the box and they were just sitting underneath my bed. So I don't know. Okay. This is another, y'all, this is so weird. These, these bottles are so all different. Like, okay, you're watching the video. So I'll just let you see. This is like a bottle that you can't see through, but it's, Brownish, like a, yeah, brown, okay. Like a chocolate brown, okay. We'll keep moving along though. Okay, this is called A Natural. Hopefully you can see that. And this, see, yeah, like just a chocolate brown color. This would be pretty for the fall. Nice chocolate brown. Sure, this would look really good with my complexion. Okay, this is another bottle that looks just like the previous one that I just did. This one is called Feeling Free. And this must just be a really light pink. Yep, I guessed it right. Um, just a light pink there. But it's not like a, like where I can probably see my nail line. It's just a pink, it's just a light pink 
that is but I bet you you can get opaque with this in one to two coats okay um okay all right so this is a twin so these are doubles so I got doubles of these which is au natural I think they said that if you order over I don't know, I can't think of the name, but I think if you order over a certain amount of polishes, you shouldn't get doubles. I'm not that worried about it. I have a daughter, I can give it to someone else, so that's it. So we got those that are doubles, and I think, let's see, when is this? Okay, now I'm coming up, this is called from their breathable line, and this just looks like a black um, silver shimmer. This one is called Bursting at the Seam. All right, bursting at the seam. This is what I think of when I think of like um, New Year's, um, New Year's Eve or New Year's Day, something like this. But you can see that there. Oh, let me get that off so I don't get this on my table. That is black with a gold shimmer in it. With, sorry, not gold. There's a silver shimmer in it, silver glitter in it. That's what that looks like there. It's pretty. All right. And their breathable line, I don't know anything about it, but I guess I'm assuming that it's just um, helps your nails to, I guess, breathe and is a better, um, it's a healthier product line of nail polish. This one is called Into Thin Air. It's like the other pink that's close to this one. They look like they could almost be twins. But this one probably looks like this may be, um, show maybe visible nail line or something like that. Cause it looks, it's definitely lighter than the other pink that I saw. Yeah, this would show my nail line, but that's not a bad thing. I don't hate that. All right, this right here is like a, it's like a milky pink white. So that's that. All right, and we're just moving on along. This box, they put they put all the breathable polishes in here. Oh, this is a this is pretty. This is like a light blue, like a baby blue, but very pastel and white. But this, I don't think this will show. Okay, look at that right there. I'll show y'all the name in just a second. I don't think. Mm, I'm trying to think. Would this? Can this be opaque? I'm not really sure. I'm not sure about that. I'd have to swatch it and see. So I'm trying to say, would this show my nail line or is this just an opaque one or two pastel light blue coats that would work on it? I'm not sure. But this one is called Flying High. This is pretty though. Um, this one is Your Biggest Fan. Ooh, I like this too. This would go cute. This would be like what's sort of like a nude for me. So this would be pretty. Look at what that looks like. That almost blends into my skin. Your biggest fan. Ooh, I like that. I can't wait to try this one out. That's what that one looks like. Um, this is like a, okay, this is like a sage green right here. This one is called Chill, Chill in the Air. Okay. And yep, just a nice sage greeny color. Whoops, that's what that one looks like there. Alrighty, I'm not sure if the sale is still going on, but you can just definitely go to colorclub.com or I think it's called maybe it's under something else and to see. But um, if you look under, I think sales or clearance or discounts, something like that, it'll show it'll, it should be the first if they're still having a sale going on. It should be one of the first um, polish um, products that comes up. All right, y'all, this is the last breathable polish that I have from Color Club. This one is called Floating Away, and this is just like a blue glitter in a clear base. That's what that looks like right there. That's cute. These would probably look cute together. If this would be the base, this polish, and then um, 
put the blue glitter on top of it or just do one little nail, like a little cute nail that'll be like your your party nail. And you can do it in all um, the all the blue glitter. Those would be nice together to pair these. Okay, so that's all the that's all the breathable line, and we're on our last polish here. Is this one that I? Oh no, I thought this is one that I had, but no, this one. Um, this was this. I thought this was a double two, but no, it's not. This is called Like a Boss, and it is like a pale yellow, pale lemon yellow. Well, no, it's not a. Yeah, it's a pale yellow. And so you see that right there. I don't know if this would look good on me or not. I don't, ooh, I don't know. I'm not sure. But I don't think this would look good on my, with my skin tone. All right, this is, ooh, this is a scented polish. Okay, yay. All right, see, it has like little, um, has the word scented on here at the top. And then also, it has the little pictures of the roses and the flowers. Okay, and this is in a frosted bottle. This one is called Long Stemmed and Lovely. Oh, that's a mouthful, okay. So this is like a darker version of this hot pink. So this is like maybe a fuchsia, let's see here. Oh. I don't know. Oh, let me shake this up because I'm not sure what this is. Okay. Okay. I think I read that their scented polishes only smell when they're dry. Yeah, that just smells like... Mm, that actually smells like roses. That is so weird. Huh. Um, I'm sort of speechless. I don't even know what to think about this. Because I'm looking at it like it should be opaque, but then it's not, it's looking like it might be like a um, a tent almost. Because I'm like, look at the top of that. Look at the, the top of the brush. Why is that color not looking, why is that color looking like light and glossy, but like a thin color versus, versus an opaque color? Huh. Not sure about that. But that's what it looks like on my skin tone. But you can see that it's not like an opaque color. It's like, a, it looks like a tint, like a darker tinted color. I'm gonna have to, okay, I'm gonna have to swatch these because I'm, I'm intrigued by this one. Long stemmed and lovely. Alrighty. Okay, here's a glitter polish. This is called Born to Sparkle. Let's see what that one is there. And this just looks like this is a, looks like um, silver and purple glitters. That's what that looks like there. Okay. Nothing special. Okay, we're down to our last three. Ooh, this is pretty. Oh my gosh. This, I cannot, oh my mind just went blank about what color this is. Um... I know it's not sage green, it's darker. What, oh, what color is this, y'all? I can't even think. Oh my God. Mm. My mind went blank, I can't think. Sign of me getting old. Okay. But this is so pretty. Oh my, like a forest green. Um, yeah, like a forest green. This is exactly what this is but it's darker. Look at how dark that is. Oh, that is so pretty. Ooh, so, so, so pretty. Okay. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Ah, yes. Okay. Gosh, this would look pretty for some nail art. If you did like had a mustard, um, like a mustard yellow base and this hat on the top and with some little lines or something like that, some abstract nail art with this tied in, this would be beautiful. Oh, and then maybe even um, put some maroon or fuchsia dark colors with it. Oh, if you can't tell, I'm already ready for winter. <laughs> All right, this is called Artsy Crafty. Yeah, that's weird. Okay, Artsy Crafty. That's what that one is. 
and is this another one that I picked up? I know we had a sage green. What is that? Okay, this one is called I Do Crew. So this is not the same one that... Okay, no, that's... Okay, that's not the same. Those aren't the same. But I thought there was another one that was a sagey green that was... Oh, of course, those aren't the same either. Okay, well, all right. Let's just look at what this one looks like. Okay, there's that one. You can get a good vibe on it. And that is called I Do Crew. And we are at our last one. This one is called, oh, oh my gosh, I can't see. Totally Available. And veil is spelled like a bridal veil, V-E-I-L. That is so cute, totally available. I don't know if you can see that. Totally available. All right, and this is like a pale, I think this is like a pale gray. If, oh, there we go. I'm gonna use my muscles there. Yeah. Okay. That's what that looks like there on my skin. All right. Okay. So, y'all, let's see. I don't think, I think we only had the one that was the, um, let's see, the one that was, the, okay. Sorry, y'all, I'm just gonna put these ladies out so you can see and sort of see what the color rainbow is that I got. And for the most part, I'm happy with everything. I didn't get anything that I'm like, ooh, I would never wear that or something that I already have. Um, Cause I, like I said, I haven't ordered from Color Club in a long time. So the only thing that I had that was the Au Natural, which was the, um, those were the doubles. Other than that, we're looking pretty good. Okay. Okay. And. Okay. Oops. All right. Can you see all of them? Okay. There. All right. So that is all 21 polishes. This one is the scented one right here. And the other ones are just the 20 um, of the ones that I got for the dollar mystery sale. So yeah, I'm happy with what I got. It's not a, I got bright, some pastels, um, a holographic, some glitter, um, some winter colors. So yeah, I'm happy with what I got. And even, so, and we got two scented polishes. So that's nice. All right, y'all, thanks for watching this video and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.